Welcome to the Daily Dad Podcast, where we provide one lesson every day to help you with your most important job, being a dad. These are lessons inspired by ancient philosophy, by practical wisdom, and insights from dads all over the world. Thank you for listening, and we hope this helps. Keep their life normal. We've talked before about how children born into privilege or power or a well-known family can easily become spoiled. Marcus Aurelius was an exception to this rule, but sadly his own son Commodus was not. But that all feels very distant. What about someone like Jimmy Kimmel, who for many, many years toiled away at the lower rungs of show business before finally launching into the stratosphere later in his career? His interesting trajectory and family provides an interesting experiment in how to raise good kids. He raised two kids in his 20s before he had much money, and now he has two kids, a three-year-old son and a five-year-old daughter, who will grow up with a lot of money. He was recently asked about how he keeps them normal, and he said, raising kids with money is a tricky thing. You don't just want to hand them everything. I don't know the best way to go about it. I've concluded that pretending you don't have money is not the best thing because kids aren't stupid. I can't say what my parents said, which is we can't afford the $60 to send you on a band trip. That won't fly. The most money I ever made when my first two kids were little was $75,000. I try to discuss this with people who have kids that are a little bit older than mine. It's always the small advice that's the best advice. Make sure they do their chores and get a reasonable allowance. You know, there's that urban legend about kids who have a private jet, and the first time they fly commercial, they ask their father, who are all these people on our plane? I don't ever want anything like that to happen. Look, it really doesn't matter whether you make 75000 or $7.5 million. Your job is to raise good kids, kids with perspective, gratitude, a healthy attitude towards money. We have to keep a Spartan attitude towards money, as Antoninus Pius did. But we also have to be reasonable and honest. We should be teaching them about working hard, about being persistent and self-reliant, about earning their keep, not being handed it. And if we can do that 30 years from now, when they make a fortune of their own, they'll know how to handle it. Thank you for listening to the Daily Dad podcast. You can also get an email version of these podcasts at dailydad.com.